So here's a nice example of an entity, entity that just doesn't come up that often. So you can see on these multiple MR images that there is a mass in the lower pole of the right kidney. Now if you look at the T2-weighted images, the mass is relatively hypo-intense, and on the post-gadolinium images, the mass is relatively hypo-enhancing and does have something resembling a central scar. Now clearly, most of the time when we're in clinical practice and you're dealing with a a solid renal mass, you're dealing with a renal cell carcinoma. And the two most common types of renal cell carcinoma that we deal with are, of course, clear cell RCCs followed by papillary RCCs. But there is a third subtype that is relatively rare, but is probably the type of tumor you'd like to have, and that's a chromophobe RCC. Now, these are technically malignant, but chromophobe RCCs have a very low rate of distant metastatic disease, and for the most part, patients do extraordinarily well. Now, it can be very difficult to make this diagnosis prospectively, but these tumors tend to be relatively hypo-enhancing, and oftentimes they look a lot like a papillary RCC, and they do have a special uh, predisposition for developing a central scar. So in many cases, these are often confused with an oncocytoma. So this is a great example of chromophobe RCC.